Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today I'm going to share with you guys how to enable navigation gestures on your device without needing root. We're going to use ADB and we're going to use a PC. This is TK and this is XDA TV. On our PC, what we need to make sure is install the latest version of the driver. So this is the OEM USB drivers for our device. If you have more specific drivers, make sure you install those. And the other thing we need to make sure is have ADB installed. I'll give you guys a link to both of those in the description below. Once you have these two installed, we need to make sure that USB debugging is turned on on our device. Now on our device, we do need to make sure to have USB debugging turned on. You go under your build number, press on the build number up to seven times, and it says you are a developer. Go into developer settings and look for USB debugging. Turn that on and then connect it to your device and authenticate it. Once we have that, we'll be able to run the command ADB devices and our device will show up. And then at this point, we know that we're ready to interface with it. When you turn the application on for the first time, you're going to be greeted with the welcome tab. Then we'll be greeted with the accessibility privilege. So you need to enable that. You need the ability to actually give it permission to do the right secure settings. So that by default without root doesn't work. So if I try to go through here, it does not work. So what we need to do here on our PC, we need to initiate this command. And I'll give you guys, of course, all this information in the description below. And the command is adb shell pm grant, and this is the application com.xda.nobar android.permission.capital write underscore secure underscore settings. And make sure you follow the capitalization correctly. And what we're doing here essentially is giving it this permission as if we had root permission. So this is in lieu of having root on our device. And what we do here and just say grant, give it a second, the prompt comes back up. And at this tab, it's providing us information that we have a, a shortcut within the quick settings tab. And now we're all set. All we have to do is turn it on and we're able to use the application. Hope you guys found this walkthrough pretty simple. Again, it is only needed if you do not have root. If you have root, all of this is not needed. You just go through on your device. And if you do have root, it's a simple command. Again, all the information will be in the description below and you'll be ready to go in no time. Thank you very much. Like and subscribe as usual to this channel. Like and subscribe to my channel. And I'll see you guys in the next video.